Yo, what's going on guys? It's iHelper, and today I'm going to be showing you how to get out of a boot loop in the new iOS 9.3.3 jailbreak. So, as you know, a boot loop is when you get stuck at the Apple logo or your themed logo on your device, and it will not turn on. And I'm going to be showing, going to be showing you how to get out of one. I don't know how to put myself into a boot loop, but I'm just going to basically show you what you need to do if you're in one. So basically, when your device is turning on, you're just going to want to hold the home and the or the yeah, the home button and the lock button until the the Apple logo or your theme logo goes away and then the Apple logo comes up. So let me just turn this on. Give you a quick demonstration. So here you see the Apple logo. Pretend I'm in a boot loop right now. You just got to hold these two buttons in for a few seconds until it goes away. And then as you see it goes away and then if I let go, they'll come back. And then your device will boot into basically the mode as if your phone died or um, <coughs> you just rebooted your phone, excuse me. And you'll see that I have weatherboard, so I'll have black uh, wallpaper. As you can see, let me just put in my passcode really quick. The only reason I'm taking my phone out of frame here is because, you know, some of my friends could be watching this and they will know my password, so I don't want that. So basically, what you're going to want to do is once you're in this state, is you're going to want to come over and either run your Pangu tool or your PP jailbreak tool. I have both of them, just because if one doesn't work, I always have a second option. Um, but for this, I'm just going to run the Pangu tool. So I'm going to recommend to you guys to leave this open for about 20 seconds or so, and then push the start button. So. You're just going to want to leave it go for about 20 seconds. You don't have to do it all the time, but for the sake of this video, I'm just going to push it now. And then you, when this screen pops up, you could usually wait about 5 seconds or so, and it's only 5 seconds, so you should be good in about now. And as soon as you get this notification, you're going to want to hold the volume up button. As soon as you get the notification. Okay, I'm not really sure why, but as I did that, my phone just kind of, uh, you know, pooped itself and went to sleep, and it just went to, um, it just kind of powered itself down. So instead of using Pangu, which I don't want it to mess up again, we're going to use the PP tool. So, and, and this time we're actually going to let it for 20 seconds. So we're just going to leave it go for about 20 seconds or so. And then once it is done, we will um, we will start up the the tutorial. But basically, as soon as you get the notification for your jailbreak tool, you're going to want to just hold the volume up button. That's literally all you have to do. It is probably the easiest thing in the world. Okay, so I'm not really sure why, but my phone just, like, it keeps shutting off and then turning itself on, just in the normal way. So, basically, I'm just going to talk you through this, and if you have problems, um, you can add me on Skype and I'll call you or something. Sorry, I was uh, interrupted right there. I don't know if you heard anything, but uh, basically, all you're going to do is, once your phone, you get the notification from either tool that you're using, and as soon as you get that, hold the volume up button. And once it turns on, you'll be in sort of a safe mode like you are when your phone turns on. But you'll notice that you can open up Cydia. So whatever you just installed, or if you just installed multiple tweaks, you're just going to want to uninstall those. And then you should be able to get out of your boot loop. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, drop a like. And if you want to see more content like this, maybe even subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.